Good morning, grandkids. Uh, let's find out what Garrett and his men are going to do today. All right, men. We couldn't get very much accomplished in the sinkhole. We have searched everywhere in there, and I can't get the other sword or whatever is needed to open that door we came to. And we've been wandering around in circles down in the sinkhole, up to the top again, back down in the sinkhole, up in the top again. Uh, I've reloaded all the bodies to see if I missed that next sword or whatever is needed to open that door. And I can't find it. None of you guys found it. So, and I haven't... We've killed everything we've seen in there. And I haven't seen any missing citizens. I tried to go in that guy's house and got caught by the guard and arrested and had to pay a fine, so let's just get on with it. I'm tired of these kind of quests that just lead to nowhere. I couldn't find any other passages. I've been down every one I've seen, and uh, heck, I'm tired of this. I want to go meandering. Do you? Let's uh, mm -hmm. see what we can find. Any thoughts, amigo? I'm wondering why we are here. <laughs> You're wondering why we're here. Well, so am I. All right, let's just let's just ride. You know where I'd really like to go, guys? I want to go up in the snowy mountains. Do you think we can find some place really far north? That's probably going to lead us back to Markarth. Let me get out my map and see what we've got marked on here. Oh no, it's not. It's going to lead up this way. Have we been anywhere up north that we could just hurry up and get to? Well, yes, we've been to Ustengrav, Fort Dunstead, Dem Hollow Crypt. I would like to go up in here in all these snowy mountains. Let's uh, go to Ustengrav and see what we can find over in here. Does that sound like a plan, boys? I just want to get out in the fresh air and travel. See what we can see. Is that all right with you guys? that up ahead I wonder I don't even want to know I want to go this away see where we can get to come on guys let's Al -you. try Al -you. <laughs> and ego you're funny This is a really swampy area, isn't it? Do you like the swampy areas? I suppose you'd like to ride around this because I know you kitty cats don't like to get wet. Good. 
Well, looky there. You might have to get wet anyway. Ah. Now, isn't this pretty, man? Look at the fresh air, the snow. It's getting evening time. shack over there. It looks like it's all burned down. There's still a fire going? Somebody's been camping out here, I'll bet. And you're always humming, Anigo. Oh my god, that fire is still a burning corpse. This looks like it's something that has just happened, man. <laughs> Sorry, people. I shall turn that off. I mean my power off. All right, that won't bother us anymore. Look, man, this must have just happened. Please. What do you think was going on here, guys? Somebody's home was totally destroyed. They had some gold. I guess they're not going to need it anymore. Oh my goodness. They got out of their bed, fell down out there, still burning, and just died. still smoldering. <laughs> well, there's nothing here that we can do for anybody, so let's go on. Very sad. I feel sorry for the family, but I don't know what was really happening there. Man, you can see why I love it since we've come into Skyrim. Wishing on a star, an ego, or are you wishing on the moon? I don't know what your cat customs are. There's 
Is that a boat down there? Shall we go down and see? You're always running into me, Inigo. What is that over there? Hmm. Let's go over and see if they want to chat. It's a camp. Oh, it's a soldier's camp. We don't want anything to do with them. They always try to take a, talk us into joining. I'm not joining anything. Maybe that's their boat down there. Whoa. Are you taking care of it, Carjo? Oh my gosh, you're surrounded by three. Shall we help them? Get out of here, Steed. We have trouble. I got this one. Again, though. You die like the rest when you mess with the best. Oh, you mess with the best. You got it, Inigo. And you guys are the best. Carjo's familiar. Well, Carjo, I didn't know you had him. Good man. When did you get him and where did you get him from? You surprised me, buddy. <gasps> He's gone. Where's our horses? Oh, they <laughs> we left them way down here. All right, we can just leave them there and go over here to the boat. Ooh, there's some horkers out there we might have to kill. I don't know if this might have been left here by the soldiers or if it's a shipwreck. Wreck of the Brine Hammer. I see. Uh, well, I think he needs to put out of his misery. Yep, got you. This vessel's voyaging days are over. Yes, it sure certainly is. Let's see what we can find on here. I think he's been dead for a long time. I wonder if that was a shipper of the, skipper of the ship. Certainly didn't have any supplies or anything with him. Now, why would he need a piece of charcoal? He doesn't even have a piece of paper or a note.
that sitting at an angle like this, boys, I feel a little disoriented. See, what's this? Their sink? Nice. That's worth some money. I will take it. Get an arrow back from you? No. Gosh, oh, for goodness sake, the critters are all over the place, aren't you? Take that. Silver ingot that fell back there. Nice. We got a chest out of this deal. Take the other thing out of there. Ah, I can get lavender all over the place. that? Oh, I can get a blessing. I might need that. That hand in the wall. He must. Whoops. Sorry. read that before. Oh. 
Oh my goodness. <laughs> you died hard. just come at you as soon as you come through the door. Can I lose on this? One. Two. Three. Oh my goodness. that iron helmet. Okay, I think we're at the end of the line here, aren't we? brought me to, but I hope I didn't waste a lot, some lock picks just opening a door to go back around where I was. Look at the skeleton laying in there. We've been in here. <laughs> so I used a lockpick to come right back in where we was. Okay, I guess we can get out of here now. Well, that was interesting, Carjo. Nigo, are you out? Yeah. Did you enjoy that? We like rustling through a wrecked ship, don't we? I don't 
see anything out here. Okay guys, let's go get our horses and see what else we can find. That was a nice what I started to say, what is that up on top of them rocks? But it's a tree. I don't think we are sailing this ship anywhere, Captain. No, we certainly aren't, Benigo. Hey boys, let's ride. Okay, which way shall we go? Let's turn down to our right. It's just so nice to be out here in the snow and the fresh air and who's that over there? Hmm. Can we sneak on our horses? No. Is that a soldier? Oh yes, we're up by their fort again. Well, I can put that away. Stay around near the coast for a while. Whoa, that was a big jump for you, my horse. But you're a good horse. Man, does that look like a ruins up on top of there? Looks sort of like doesn't look like rocks, it looks like man-built to me. I wonder where we would get up there at. Over there. Here's another soldier. I think, uh-oh. Find safety, beast. I will see you soon. Oh, find safety, beast. I will see you soon. Aw, Anigo. You're so good to your horse. I want to see who this was. A bandit outlaw. Well, he's got some orcish arrows, that's good. I will not be looting my corpse. You like to steal, huh? You can have this for free.
Hmm. That wasn't too productive. like there's something else over here too. Oh, they're man-made steps, I'm sure. Maybe they're not steps. Maybe it's another... Oh, you startled me, dear elk. That's another one of them places like Ustengrad. Windward Ruins? Gotta help me keep notes of these places, boys. I wonder if I can peek through this little window here. Hmm. Let's get this over with. <laughs> Good job. some room. Okay, let's go around here and find the entrance to this place. If there is one, I didn't see any stairs from up there. Must have been. Let's just jump down, guys. All right. Activate pedestal. There isn't anything on it. I don't want to just activate everything I see. Here's the entrance. easily missed. Well, isn't there anything in here? Except that person you guys killed? Ooh, there's a skeever. Is that what you killed? I thought it was a man. What is this place? I don't understand it. Alright, activate this and see what happens. It doesn't activate. Well, it probably belongs to one of those quests or bulletin board okay let's just go
see how easy we can get up to the, this mountain and see what that thing is up there. What is this? I see a wolf up there. Practicing your archery. Uh, time to go to work. Yeah, time to go to work. I'm not doing a very good job. Rest forever. This is right off of a road. Can't really see easily how you get up to it, but let's have a look. like a shrine of some kind. What is this? Ooh. Shrine of Dibella. I think I've read this. I guess not. Hmm. Sorry guys, I rode my horse right up on the top of there. Let's head over here and see what this is. did I see up there? Ah. I don't understand what my bow is doing. I'm looking one way and it suddenly starts looking another way. Be careful. Let me find some of my arrows. I have been unintentionally shooting all over the place.
Onward and upward, man. I don't see any lookouts around. There's some old tattered flags. I hope it's not a Legion or Stormcloak stronghold. It looks pretty torn down. Maybe it's occupied by bandits. Oh, alright. I'm gonna leave my horse right here. Protect yourself, Steve. <gasps> Whoa! <laughs> They're after another one. Let's see what we get out of these. Frostbite venom. Great. And arrows. Ooh, an ebony arrow he had. Mm-hmm. Was that from you, an eagle? It's mine now. <laughs> Sorry, bud. All right, which way do we want to go to find the entrance? I think I want to bring my horse a little closer before I go in there. Caller Temple. I'm going to park you right there. Today will be a good day. Do you think I can so? feel it in my fur. Ooh, you can feel it in your fur? <gasps> Maybe it will be. Guys, on the map, it says this is Night Caller Temple. Um, there's no telling what might be in here. But let's go find out. Looks like a cult worship place. of St. Alicia. We'll take it. Now, why was there this division between those seats and this seat? of St. Alicia. Lost Legends. 
I'm going to take that. That might be something we can look for. diseases from them stupid rats we can be cured okay guys you know of course that this has to do with a quest so let's read that book that we picked up what was it Lost Legends. This is written by an elder in Winterhold. The history of Skyrim is vast. Much has been lost. The people of Morthal have told whispered tales of the Pale Lady. Guys, maybe we're going to be on the trail of a Pale Lady. A ghostly woman who wanders the northern marshes, forever seeking her lost daughter. What happened to her daughter? Some say she steals children who wander astray. Others that her sobbing wail strikes dead all those who hear it. But behind these tales may lie a kernel of truth, for ancient records speak of Amriel, a mysterious figure, this grimoire's heirs battled for decades and finally sealed away. Hmm. Reachmen tell the story of Phelan Red Eagle, an ancient king who rallied his people and drove. What does this pale lady have to do with Red Eagle? rallied his people and drove back the armies of Cyrodiil with a flaming sword. <gasps> Guys, I'd like to have a flaming sword. Though accounts vary, they too seem to be based on an underlying truth. The Imperial Chronicles of Empress Hestra mention a rebel leader of that era who was eventually cornered and slain in battle at the cost of a full legion of men. But some tales prove far harder to analyze. Among scholars, perhaps the best known is the forbidden legend of the Archmage Galder. In the dawning days of the first era, the story goes, there lived a powerful wizard by the name of Galder. Wise and just, he was well known in the courts of King Harold and the Jarls of Skyrim and his aid and counsel were sought by men and mere alike. And then he was murdered. Some say one of his sons killed him. Wow. Others, that King Harold, jealous of his power, gave the order. But Galder's three sons fled into the night, pursued by a company of Harold's best warriors and the Lord Grearmond, the king's personal battle mage. A great chase ensued from the wilds of the Reach to the glacial north. One brother is said to have perished in the ruins of Valgunther at the foot of solitude. Wow. The others were run to ground soon thereafter, and once it was done, King Harold ordered every record of their murders destroyed, and Galder's name and deeds were struck from the rolls of history. I thought everybody liked Galder. His son's name should have been struck from the rolls of history. Even today, few sources remain. 
and no bard will tell the tale. But perhaps the truth yet remains in some ancient ruin waiting to be unearthed. For nothing is ever truly forgotten. Wow. Wait, I want this. I did read it. And now I want to keep it. Where are we crying out loud? Mystery of Talara, Volume 2. Oh, do I already have? I already have. said let's read it of course I have it stupid we read that we read that what is that noise and where are you guys do we want to do this where are you got a book in there, Anigo, and it tells of a legend that really sounds cool. We could go find these. Would you guys like to do this? It's a very good mystery, and I can't get any farther in there. Alright, we'll do it. Maybe we'll seek this out and see what happened and who we can find and what we get out of it. We're always adventuring. All right, guys, we're going to do this. Grandkids, we are going to leave it here. And when we come out back, we're going to find out what this legend is about. Okay? So I will see you all next time. Let's say this right here. And I could take another picture. Let me save it again so it won't get lost. And I'm out of here, kids. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.